Today's Gospel at Mass got me thinking about a word that we use all the time, and I wondered what the dictionary definition of it would be. Hello, I'm Father James Kabicki, and the word that's central to the Gospel today is forgiveness. We use that word all the time, but what does it mean? The dictionary says, to give up claim to requital, to pardon, to give up resentment, to remit the penalty. In other words, forgiveness recognizes that a wrong was done and that justice requires that a penalty be paid. Forgiveness isn't saying to someone, oh, no harm done, don't worry. Forgiveness recognizes that harm was done, but it doesn't hold on to the hurt, allowing it to further hurt us by turning it into a resentment. And it's not so much letting the other person off the hook as sacrificing one's own right to have justice done and in that way, imitating Jesus, the innocent one who sacrificed himself to save the world from sin. I can just imagine Peter thinking what a great and generous guy he was as he asked Jesus, Lord, if my brother sins against me, how often must I forgive him? As many as seven times? And then imagine how his face changed when Jesus told him, not seven times, but 77 times a figure that was supposed to represent always. Basically, Jesus told him, if you want to follow me, the one who will die in order to forgive the sins of the world, you must also die to yourself and always forgive. Is there someone you have a hard time forgiving? Lent's a good time to pray for the grace to let go of the hurt and to ask God to help you forgive as he does.